Today's adventure brings us to Gatorland, Orlando, where we'll be getting a little behind the scenes, up close and personal tour with gators, crocodiles, and who knows what else. I'm inviting you to join me. Shall you? Yeah. Harley. Now you met Harley. You never met Harley before. I never did. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Only this one. All the other ones will take your fingers off. So yes, they will. Right yes, they will. Yes, they will. I love how you just naturally Kef. just held that bird, dude. Give me a kiss. I just put his arm up there and just put it on him. He didn't really. Have I didn't a have a choice. Yeah. You didn't have a choice. It's right here on my hand. Hi. Can you dance? You're gonna dance? Can I dance? <laughs> yeah. But cockatoos are very, very dusty. There you go. Whoa. They're very dusty and they have a lot of dander on them. So if you were to pet Holly like this, right? Yeah. So oh, look at the dust. The alligators, the albinos, and the leucistics can't be in the direct sunlight. They don't have any pigment in their skin. The leucistics have a little bit, but not enough. So the Florida sun in the middle of summertime will definitely burn their skin. So we have these shade cloths over, so they get some filtered sunlight, and if they want to get in the direct sunlight, they can, but there's only little teeny places they can do that. Um, and that keeps them safe. So we've got them all outside now, and they're just having a ball, which was always the plan since they've been at Gatorland. Sure. And we'll go in there and feed a couple of them. What year was this structure built? October last year. So it's brand new. October last year is when it opened. So this is Big Pearl right here. And then that little alligator's name is Misty. And then up there is Moonshine and Cottontail. Oh, over there. Moonshine and Cottontail. I've never seen any of this before. This is all new to me. So these were in uh, closer to the entrance of the park before. Yes, they were. In that enclosure. They were, absolutely. And then we'll walk up this big guy right here. His name is Sarah. He's a leucistic alligator. So there are seven of these in the world from the same clutch of eggs. Barrows is leucistic, so he has a little bit of pigment still in him. Those are those patches. And then he has blue eyes. And then this little girl alligator is heterozygous. It's heterozygous for the same gene. Heterozygous. Right, so that means she holds the gene for leucism, oh. but you can't see it on the outside. Okay. So, that's Mary Kate, and that's Ashley. Oh. And that's Sparrow, and that over there is Trezo. Is that bird, is that bird Olsen? And the, <laughs> yeah, that's a great name for him. Now he is. <laughs> There's also a big great hair that hangs out in here too, but maybe we call him Danny. <laughs> <laughs> I like the theming back in here. Yeah, it's cool, huh? Yeah, the Emporium over here and the fresh fixings. Oh. That's meat. That's prime grade A steak. Yeah, it is. Throw some salt and pepper on that. Smoke it for about six hours. You ain't gonna eat that. Fall apart in your mouth. Your lunch is here. That's my. That's not my lunch. Yeah. Uh, okay, this is a little too close for comfort. Come on, girlfriend. So normally we don't play with them when they're up on the land because we want them behind us and now they're kind of in two places at one time, which is really great. I gotta go to Swamp Buggy. Why? Where should I be standing? Uh, you can come up this way. Alright, we'll come up this way. I'm gonna make this little girl go down here. Water. So you don't want to get in between the two of them? No, I guess not. Those are great. Good behavior, and that's really the time when they they get fed. So they like that. 
Yeah. They respond well to that. They're very, very simple, very primitive. They're going to do the, the same routine, the better the routine, the, the better they're going to do the same thing over and over and over. So uh, it works out really, really well. Uh, I use a hold. As soon as they hold, Back up, one back up. Hold. Hold real quick. Hold. Pearl, come on, Pearl. Now, I started training Pearl a long time ago, and I got him really, really good condition. We actually had a birthday party for him, pulled him out, had all these kids singing behind him, and it was totally unrehearsed. My boss was like, can you get Pearl out here and spin him around and do all this stuff? I'm like, yeah. They'll shrink up real thin. So they have a really good elasticity in their pupils. It helps them see in low light. So when they're at nighttime, their pupils will open up all the way, and they'll let it in all the low light they can see, so that's helping them see a lot better. That's their ear, right here. That's wow. their skin, that's his ear, it flips up. They have what's called uh, a nictating membrane, or third eyelid. So oh there's three eyelids, one on the top, one on the bottom, and the one that slides from front to back. And that kind of keeps all the sand, st trash, sticks, and stuff out of their eyes. Now why is, why is that one the only non-albino in here? Um, it was just really to, to, to gauge how to, to get along. Territorial pearl would be, to be 100% honest with you. It wasn't like, oh, we're just gonna throw this one out. It was, it was really thought out. Like, okay, this gator's around the same size as the gators that we're using. You know, we want to see if there's gonna be any aggression at all. And we did it in a way where everyone got introduced to a new exhibit at the same time. So it wasn't like anybody had any territorial issues. They all just kind of, oh, a new house, cool, okay, and they kind of got along pretty well. We don't like y'all. He's like, anti-social. He's in the water. Perk. Did you let them feed him? I fed him here. You guys want to feed him? I put the glove on. Yeah. Got my right. glove. So we're gonna go down this way a little bit. And what we're aiming for is, so you can't really see him because Pearl doesn't have any pig butt. All those little spots are called ISO sensors, and they all stand for integumentary sensory organ. I won't let him eat you, don't worry. Okay. So what you're going to do is you're going to throw it to the side of his face, like okay. there or there, a little closer, because it's got to hit those sensors. Oh. As soon as it hits those sensors, he'll fire. So it's like they really don't even see it until it hits those sensors. It doesn't actually exist. Right. But it's like right here on the side. There you go. Bird. Good job. Bird. Now, Pearl's like nine feet, no bio Alright, so I'm gonna try and actually physically let it touch the side of the face. Um, you're gonna let go like right here. All so right. it lands right there where the side of the face is. Perfect. Yeah, Perfect. Nice. But yep, when it hits that side of the face, it automatically responds. He's automatically gonna turn and try to grab it. When Ooh. we go on the other one, I'm gonna let you throw it right in his mouth. Oh, it's awesome. a little different. But he'll stand up and he'll hold it in a good position. Nice. Do you wanna do it again, Adam? Adam? We really haven't gotten Pearl. I've been working with it, Pearl. Smile, smile, smile. Nice, close, close. So dainty. I like it. So dainty. <laughs> I can't believe you passed your camera over to me because you don't even know how many cameras She's I lose. She's broken everything. She's broken cameras. <laughs> <laughs> She's lost phones, cameras. Cameras, tripods, phones. I've got them all around the world. Oh, and the other one's coming. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Take the phone. Oh, that white alligator just screwed up on you. I'm getting one of the pictures. Can you take it with me? Yeah, you? but I get in the water. No, but just maybe come over here. That's horrifying. That's terrifying. <laughs> hey, guess what? Y'all got to go back now. I wasn't kidding. You weren't kidding. <laughs> no. If he would have crawled up, I would have stopped him with my mind. I have Jedi power. A baby. We lost a baby. A pacifier. One, two, three. Take one more. One, two, three. Nice. I'm like, I'm semi okay. Straight up! He swims over every morning. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. That's very strong. How many are in this? How many are in here? Two of them? Three if you count that one right there. No, I'm oh. sure. I'm just wondering if there's any behind us or anything. Jason! Jason! Let's go!
Let's go, a piece. So just the two we're seeing. Trezo. Yeah, there's just two in here. Um, Trezo and Ash. Trezo, here, here, let's go. Come on, man. I ain't got all day. I got things to do. Let's go. Come on, Trezo. Can I get him to come right up here in the middle? Oh. Trezo, here, here. Whoa, what is it? Oh, it's the, it's the bucket. <laughs> That's startled me. Put that on your stone okay. here. Right. Come on, big man. Come on, Trezo. Oh, my goodness. Trezo, it's up, up, big blue eye monster. I love it. Up, come on, Trezo. Come on, big boy. Up. I know he looks fake, like he animatronic, looks so right? Fake, yeah. Trezo, it's up. Keep it up, good boy, good boy. Hold. Thank you, thank you. So this is when that whole behavior. Hold, hold. Don't jump. I don't want you to jump. Open. There you go. Trezos, come on, buddy. Trezos, here, here. Let's go, come on. All right, this is a cool photo. So you two guys go this way. Come this way. Go right behind me. Trezos, here. Trezos, up. Here, there you go. Get in there. Crush down real low so it's hard to get back up. Let me see your camera. Haha, uh -huh, now you're stuck with no phone. Good luck. Oh, no. Don't think of my phone. Oh. Crouch down. Scoot in like you like each other. What are you doing? Uh, yeah, it's like a little worry. Don't worry. I'm faster than him. All right, big smiles look happy. Nice. Not really happy, but nice. I mean, nice. Hold it, hold it. We got to do it this way. You know, like follow the grammar and do it this way. Oh, my gosh. Let's hurry this up. Nice. Hold it, hold it. Hold, hold it. Hold on, up. hold on. This is awesome. Hold it, hold it. <laughs> Nice. I'm not comfortable right now. Nice. Good job. Good job. Don't bring that over here. That thing fights what is more. happening to my life That's right now? Oh my god. Nice. 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 I'm trying to keep these people alive. I want to come over and see the turtle, but I'm cut. I, uh... Did you see that? Yes, yeah, you stretch. I got a picture like that. I got you. The I neck was stretching out. I'm just like really concerned with. Oh, don't be. This is all part of the show. Oh my gosh. I like to keep people scared. <laughs> I am sweating profusely <laughs> right now. <laughs> Wait till we go with Chester. This is nothing. <laughs> I know it's hot and humid here in Florida, but this is that is fear. All right, if you miss, if you miss, we're probably going to die. So don't miss. All right. Oh, no. Uh, smile. Oh, 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 oh! You missed. Get it. You can throw it again. Hurry up. Smart, smart. Stay there. Just get it. Trace up. Smile. 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 Don't jump. Smile. All right. Oh, oh. A rip. All right. We both. We what? Let him try again. I will jump this thing. <laughs> I will literally jump this fence in five seconds. Don't miss. All right, all right, all right. here we go. Stay right here by the door. I go by the door? Yeah, right here, right in front. Trade those smile. Smile. No! Nice. Oh, no! Nice. Oh, oh. <laughs> Trade those. Trade those. Yeah, all right. Well, yeah, only, good job. Only, Forward until I back the bottom. So he really only comes forward until I found the hole or something. Forward's really the only one. He's a very forward creature. I can turn him around all the way. Trezo. How is that? That was Trezo, here. I haven't wrapped my head around it yet, but this is incredible. Trezo. He's looking at me. He's staring at me. Trezo, big boy up here. Come on. Come on, Trezo. Trezo, come on. Trezo, come on. Come on, Trezo. Whoop. He does swing back wide. Come on, Trezos. Come on, big boy. Trezos, Trezos. Come on, big boy. <laughs> Come on, big boy. Yeah, see those puppy things right behind us? I don't like back? being in this spot. Yeah, those are his jowls. That would produce about 2,000 pounds per square inch in a bike. Wow. So, yeah, this would not be very fun to get up. 
anything happens, we have definitely a lot of people watching. It will be documented. So, here's the deal. Enough! One day that mugger wasn't enough! Oh, well, that's with crocodiles. That's a little different. I'm talking about alligators having a range of motion. Like, he, he's not a cartoon character. He can't leap 12 feet off the ground. He can't run 35 miles an hour. He's going to do things when he builds up to uh, kind of signal that he's, he's getting in position. He's going to put these back feet, tuck them behind him, so he's getting like a like that runner stance going before he takes off and you can see him he's backing up now he's not in that forward kind of charge motion oh, it's pretty tall. oh i can hear yeah yeah just there big boy am i following you yeah follow me yeah might as well come on come on come on come on come on oh, oh sorry come on, come on. okay here like, remember how he said, don't miss or you'll die? Yeah. Well, this is serious, so. Justin! Justin, big boy! All right, you want to get it in there? Ooh, nice, nice. Ooh. That is a thunderous right, growl. Justin, All right, Chester. big boy, smile! Justin, big boy, smile! Nice. Oh my gosh, that was so loud. Woo! So that's what 2,000 pounds per square inch sounds like. Up front and serious. Just that, big boy! Oh my oh. lord. got food in his mouth. I know, I know. But you get in there and get it out and we'll nope. try it again. Nope. And he's been known to eat dogs. He, he has actually, eaten dogs. He's eaten people's dogs in Tampa. In 2002, he was the dog eater. And uh, they trapped him and they were going to euthanize him. And they sold him to Gatorland. He's been here ever since 2002. So he's like the ambassador for wild caught alligators in a theme park. You can't help it, it's not his fault he ate the dogs. People shouldn't feed wild alligators. And because those people fed wild alligators, other people lost their animals. And that's what happens a lot of times in the state of Florida. It's very unfortunate for not only the humans, the dogs, but also for animals like Chester. Oh, that is, that is oh, way oh, too, oh, 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 where's he going? He's leaving, no. he's leaving. No. See you, Chester. Please. Tired of the paparazzi. I, I kind of didn't want to photo something real close to him anyway, so I'm perfectly fine, Chester. Just wade in the water there. It's hot out. <laughs> yeah, y'all get there by his tail. I'm, you want me to get by his yeah, tail? Yeah, hold this. You get there by his uh, tail. I'll I don't know if you're joking guy. or no, being serious. No, get by his tail. You're not oh, my kid. <laughs> get Yeah, get there. Get low. Don't worry. Don't worry. I got you. Chester, <laughs> fresh meat. <laughs> Do I look not scared? You look terrified, but that's all right. Let me get another angle. Let me get a better angle. Crouch back down there. Oh, he just opened his eyes. Oh, Chester, he's got fresh meat. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Seriously, done. He's super lazy. You're good. He's good. He's like I said, he's a superstar. He's done. He I'm lazy too, but I like to eat. Buddy, here. Good boy. Yeah, buddy's big. Buddy. I think he's bigger. You think Don't he's you bigger? Think? You think he's bigger than Chester? I think he's bigger than Chester. So this is all his area from the corner of that beach over there all the way back to here and then back there. This is Buddy's territory. So if you notice everybody starts to slow down right there. Oh yeah. Except for his girlfriend, Gwendolyn, who's right there. Mm. I don't know who this is. He's like rogue in here, but you can tell Buddy might have told him he needs to be on his way. And then that's uh, Bogey. So Bogey came from a golf course in Orlando this year. How do you tell if it's a girl or a boy? Um, in here, I can only tell if I know for sure if I check their cloaca or the smaller ones in here are normally girls. Mm -hmm. Except for Buddy's girlfriend is a really big girl. She lives under there. But I don't know about this one. Craftsman! Craftsman, come here, hurry! Craftsman's gonna talk when he comes up here, so you gotta try to, try to, try to listen. Craftsman! Here! I'm right here. What can you say? Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's the most vocal, probably, of all of them here. That's awesome. Thank you, Craftsman! So either the two siblings threw the other one out of the nest or the mom threw it out. Birds are 
Yes. Nobody knows. Nobody knows about birds, man. He got into a fight and he bit the other alligator and he bit it so hard that he cracked his own jaw. How did they get their names? This one's Predator, but where did they Because it's like a predator. You know, like the movie Predator? Yeah. <laughs> like when it does <laughs> Okay. Predator. That's right. Come on, Predator. I'm here. <laughs> there comes Olsen. Olsen coming in hot to Predator. <laughs> Lightning! Lightning! Oh! Told you he's crazy. And I can't even tell you how many times he almost killed me. <laughs> this is Lightning and this is his brother Sharpie. And the two of them Look have fast. the strangest eyes of any alligator I've ever seen in my life. Like his are white. He's like trying to get you right now. I know. Here comes Ricardo. He's probably everybody's favorite crocodile here. Now, would they react to me if I walked up and said, hey, Ricardo? Maybe. Yeah. I don't know for sure. <laughs> That's a big old smile. <laughs> yeah, those are some serious teeth. Oh, I was going to jump the fence and, let, and try to get you a better shot. Ricardo! See how big their nostrils are right now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're trying to smell if I have anything in this bucket or not. Wow. You're supposed to be on the other side of the fan. You're doing it wrong. You don't get cooled down on the back side of it. Are we having a staring contest now? Is that what's happening? Who's gonna blink first? I'm not gonna blink. Wait, do squirrels blink? We're having a serious staring contest right now. I'm not turning away. Okay, I give up, you win. Well, I have to congratulate your YouTube channel. You have just crossed 100,000 subscribers. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting for us. It's still growing. Yes, so we just got our silver play button. It's so exciting. I didn't even know how to edit a video when I made our channel. I just wanted everybody to see how great Gatorland was. Where can they find the link? What's the what's the address? It's uh, Gatorland Vlogs on YouTube. And thank you for coming to see us. We yeah. love it when you visit. Thanks for having us. So everything we saw today, you'll see more detailed on what you guys are doing on it's your channel. It's a little bit scarier. A little scarier? <laughs> A little scary. I think what we did today was pretty scary. Yeah, that was pretty scary. It's a little bit scarier. Just check it out. It's Gator Land Vlogs. Awesome. Thanks for having us. Thanks for coming. That's going to do it for today. If you're new here, please subscribe. By doing so, it helps keep you in the loop and update on future uploads here on this channel. Take it a step further. Ring that notification bell. And if you enjoyed this particular episode, give it a big thumbs up. It lets me know you care. I'll see you in the next video. The vlog is over. <laughs>